for taking time. Come over and visit with me over on Fritz's Cooking again. I'm Fritz, and I reckon it's time for another Sunday cook, y'all. And guys, I've seen a bunch of my great friends on here uh, preparing some hamburgers. And what I wanted to do is uh, I'm going to do some myself, and it's going to be a really easy and simple and delicious recipe. And I guarantee it's going to be beat that brown bag all up. Uh, guys, what I'm going to make is uh, what I call a Big Fritz. And basically what we're going to do is put my spin on a Big Mac, guys. And what I have here is some 80-20 Black Angus uh, hamburger meat. I've got a little bit of lettuce. I'm going to chop that up a little bit better. And I've got some onion that I'm going to dice up uh, as fine as I can. Um, we've got some uh, traditional uh, uh, seeded uh, hamburger buns here and some cheese. And along with that, I want to make uh, Fritz's special sauce. And uh, we're going to serve it alongside some Rally's uh, seasoned french fries, guys. All right, y'all, let me get after this. I'm going to do it up in the black iron skillet, and I'm hoping they're going to be super tasty. I hope y'all are going to enjoy it. Okay, guys, thank you okay, so guys, very much. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and get started here. And first things first, I'm going to make uh, Fritz's special sauce here, and I'm going to utilize some Duke's mayonnaise, some of this uh, Brooks uh, ketchup, a little bit of sweet relish, a little bit of chili powder, a little bit of onion powder, guys. Piece of cake to make. All right, guys, what I'll do is I'm going to take me several dollops of the mayonnaise here. And guys, you can, you know, basically it's sort of like Thousand Islands, if you will. And, you know, whatever I have left over, we'll actually, you know, utilize it on a salad or something or actually making a sandwich or whatnot. Okay, guys, we got our mayonnaise. Let's go ahead and get our ketchup in here. All right, guys. Now I'm going to go ahead and take my sweet relish. I'm going to dump in the whole thing here. It's probably about tablespoon and a half or so. All right, guys, I'm going to go ahead and take uh, roughly about a iced teaspoon, a little less, of uh, the Mexican chili powder. Take a little bit of onion powder. About an iced teaspoon full. I love onions. All right, guys, and I'm just going to put in just a little bit of fresh cracked black. Go ahead and stir this dude on up. And guys, this is all about your own taste, what you like. I mean, if you wanted garlic powder in it, you can add some garlic powder. Do a little taste. Delicious. All right, guys, we're ready to get started, and I'm going to make like, you know, some uh, thin burgers here. So, ain't going to take a whole lot of meat. That's the thing, too, man. When you make these guys, uh, it's pretty economical. You're not using a whole, whole ton of... Uh, Hamburger meat. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and make uh, three to start with. It's probably all I, all I can get in my pan. But uh, I'm taking a little cutting board here, flatten these dudes out. guys and what I'm actually gonna do I've got my my black iron skillet here it's it's pretty hot I had to cut it back a minute but I'm just gonna put in a little bit of uh, uh, canola oil I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna canola oil one side of my my burger here as well all right guys now let's go ahead and get it on up into the mix here Alright guys, let's take a peek at them. Oh yeah. That's what I'm looking for right there guys. A little bit more salt. And we are cooking downtown y'all. Look at that y'all. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Probably about two minutes on each side. All right, guys, we're ready to pull round one. Look at them, man. Mm -mm -mm. Sort of in between a Big Mac and a Steak and Shake. All right, guys. I'll go ahead and get these in here. Key is frying at high heat. All right, guys, let's take a peek. Oh yeah! All right, guys, I think these are looking pretty good. Just did a little taste test. We're ready to rock here, guys. Let's go ahead and get our next ones in. Gotta be perfect, guys. It's gotta taste good. All right, guys, let's take a piece of these. Okay guys, we're ready to pull mom. I didn't put no sauce on her. Oh my god. As you can tell, one is already missing. It is freaking out of this world good. Alright guys, we'll get right back to you. All right, guys, let's select this puppy. You want some bowling? Oh, yeah, man. I'm here to tell you. It smells marvelous up in here. All right, guys, we're ready to pull this bad boy. Mmm. All right, y'all. Let me get my onions done. I got my fries up in the oven. We're good to go. All right, guys, our fries are just about done. I'm gonna go ahead and kill them. Went ahead and I cleaned up my mess, man. I had grease everywhere, guys. So I'm, I'm kind of funny about keeping a clean, clean ship here. But uh, anyway, guys, let's go ahead and start with mom's. Um, I didn't put any salt on her burgers whatsoever. So what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna just take just a little bit of the special sauce. And this is just the way I do it, on the bottom bun here. And then I'm gonna take uh, some of the onions Put them on there like so. She's not a big onion eater, so I won't put a ton on there. All right, guys, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take uh, uh, one, of, well, actually, we're gonna take a piece of cheese first. Then we're gonna take one of the patties. And I'm gonna come up here and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna paint just a little bit more on our middle bun here. Put that dude on like so. And then we're gonna take uh, uh, our last patty here, we're gonna put it on. And I'm gonna take some uh, pickles, just two pickles. Put a little bit of cheese up on it, like so. I'm gonna take my Fritz's special sauce here, put some on there. And we're gonna take a little bit of these uh, lettuce here and just merely pile it on just like so. Put a little toothpick in this so I'll remember which one's hers. All right, guys, take a peek at that. I think that looks pretty daggone good. All right, guys. Go ahead and take this over here. Put it like so. 
All right, y'all. Now, same thing. A little special sauce. A little special sauce. We'll take some onions. Put them down. Onions on this one. Just like so. We'll take a little bit of cheese. Put it down. A little bit of cheese. Put it down. Then we're going to take a couple of my burgers. Put them down like so. And I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to paint up a little bit of this. With a special sauce or middle bone. Same thing here. Alright guys. Now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take our burgers. I'm going to put them down. Put a little bit of cheese up on them. All right, grab a couple pickles. Do you all be patty special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on sesame seed bun, yeah? We're taking this to the next level. All right, guys, now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of this lettuce here. And you know how they always pile that lettuce on. All right, guys, take a little bit more of the special sauce. Put that on, get that on there like so. We're going to take a little bit more of the special sauce. Put that on like so. Grab us a heaping mound of lettuce here. Like so. And there we go, guys. That's a Fritz, Fritz Mac, baby. Fritz Mac. All right, y'all. Get them over to the table. Hey, Bowie. You garden, you garden the big Fritz's? All right, guys. We got the big Fritz's over to the table with uh, Fritz's special sauce there. And guys, I don't, I'm don't. i sure a bunch of y'all can remember. Maybe some of the younger ones can't. But that's about what a Big a big Mac used to be that big. And they're, they're trying to say they haven't changed it. And I'm here to tell you they have, man. Everything's like, like getting smaller. But uh, guys, we're going to get into this. And we got some of our rally fries. And I think we're ready to rock, guys. I think those look excellent. All right, oh, guys. Let me get plated up. Mm. Tastes better? Or? Better than a Big Mac. Is that right? All right. All right, guys. I got this together in about 45 minutes, guys. This could have been one of my Working Wednesday videos. Look at this, guys. I already sampled one of them patties. <laughs> but uh, anyway, man, I think that looks amazing. All right, guys. Let me get after this. Now, I I'm here to tell you, Big Macs have shrunk. <laughs> but... Yeah, but uh, Big Fritz is good for you. All right, guys. Mmm. It does taste better. Mmm. Oh my goodness, it's delicious. It's fresher too. Oh yeah, I think it lays around in there for a while. Mm. Heck, hold on, let me get another big old bite. Mm. Oh my goodness, guys. Give me a couple rally fries. Dipping it in that for, uh, special fritz sauce. Pretty good. Mm. I love rally season fries, guys. I think that turned out pretty daggone good. If you're pretty fancy, ain't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> ain't that something, guys? Getting you a big fritz together in less than 45 minutes or so. And uh, I'm here to tell you, it is a taste treat. It's extravaganza. Guys, let me get one more bite here. Mm. Get a little more extra sauce here, special sauce. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Well guys, I know this wasn't nothing spectacular or nothing tonight, but uh, I had fun on my my, uh, my Sunday cook here and I'm hoping y'all uh, 
had a little fun too as well and I'm hoping uh, y'all enjoy it and uh, guys I just wanted to say thank you so very very much for coming over and watching me every Sunday guys and it truly does mean the world to me I do appreciate the friendship and the fellowship and it I just love hearing from y'all so uh, guys I'm hoping you're gonna come back and see me Wednesday for another working Wednesday and I reckon we're gonna holler at y'all soon thank you so very very much take care Bye.